Ladies and germs, welcome back to the dungeon. I'm gonna be bringing some stuff down. So, gentlemen, welcome to the dungeon. Today, we are going to start turning this microwave into a furnace. So, at work, at my work, I work with really big hot ovens, and we have all this ceramic fiber board and ceramic fiber wool. So today, we are going to be taking all of this and putting it in that. Hooray! So, let me get the camera set up and so, we can work. Step one is to disassemble. So, in about an hour and a half's time, we have taken a microwave and we've turned it on its side to be a little foundry. So, Sunday, when the electronicals come in, we're going to wire them up and we're going to fill it with heating elements and we're going to melt some aluminum. So, to recap, we insulated the door, the walls, and 
the entire outer casing with ceramic fiber wool and some board on the bottom, back, and top. And we're going to put the uh, electric dial right up here and the box for it in there. And we'll make some sort of latch because that's not being closed. And it's uh, going to have its... Uh, regular old electric cord so it'll look just like a regular microwave but instead it'll melt metal totally metal man yeah today folks is part two of three of our little electric kiln here we got our heating element in the mail and so we have to install it now I'm going to try my best to stay out of the camera view, and we're going to use, and yes, I might get some crap for this, but ah, these are the only ones I could find, galvanized steel nails, so I will uh, bake this so that way the galvanization doesn't kill me, uh, but the uh, uh, wire here I'm going to stretch out. So that way we can install it. It's in this nice tight spring here. So we're gonna stretch it out little bits at a time. All right. And, oh snap, I forgot to order my voltage regulator for this because Amazon Hopefully well, not Amazon. The, the seller sent me the sort of wrong one. Even heating. I'll include a picture of the one they sent this. me. Which is a DC voltage regulator. And that would not have worked well had I plugged it into the wall. Yes. So, I set that back today. And... Well, all right, so if you see what I did here, I went all the way to the top. And I didn't leave any space for my Jesus top insulation brick. So now I've got to mark where the top of that is. Uh, take it all apart again. So, once we get the electronic relay, there's a little dial control for right here, then we will have our little 
my little foundry. My little foundry. Oh, some sweet foundry. Ah, my little foundry. I want to melt all the metal things. My little foundry. To do. And then once the electronics come in, we'll put the lid back on and edit the video and we'll be all done. Hooray!